wonder where we should go next. Yeah, maybe there. Ah, Zepho, my favorite place. But when this is all over, I think it'll be time to settle down, you know, fall in love, start a family. Love? You? Yeah, you think a guy like me doesn't know love? I bet you're gonna tell me. Let me tell you, it's the best, but a lot of work. It needs admiration, devotion, attraction, and respect. Breeze, that's actually very insightful. Yeah, well, it comes with experience. <laughs> Can't look this good and not steal a few hearts. <laughs> <laughs> I bet. We're about to drop out of hyperspace. Sit down. Think of a storm brewing down there. This might not be the best time to land. Eh, yeah, something strange. Those winds are interfering with our comms. Hey, Cordova mentioned something about peace in the eye of the storm. Well, I can just make out a settlement in the middle of it. Then we have to get there. Copy that. Bubbles ain't gonna kill you, kid. <laughs> Unless the wind picks up. Can you tell that bucket of balls to keep his opinion to himself? I'm sure everything's under control. Because it's under control, it's just a little tricky. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Perfect landing. <laughs> Crazy money, baby. Uh, but I'm still getting a lot of interference on the comms. It's gonna take me a minute to get them back up. I'll search for signs of Cordova in the meantime. Good. I'll be in touch once I crack this. Cal, over here. You did good work on Pagano. The more information we gather on Cordova and the Zepho, the closer we'll get to stopping the Empire. I've heard of ancient cultures, but don't know much about them. I only knew that Cordova was obsessed with the Zepho, believing their teachings to be important. I, too, was intrigued by the mysteries of our galaxy. You better get moving. There's a lot to learn here. Good luck. I can see you two have been through a lot. It's not easy. No, it's not. But I think of those who believed in me at one point. If I give up on myself, then I give up on them. I'm sure you have a few of those. Prof, uh, friend on Braca. He sacrificed himself so I could live. He believed in you. A lot of people depend on you, even if they don't know it yet. Keep going, Cal. For Prof. For everyone. He wants a helpful droid. He does seem to be warming up to you. Cordova must have really liked droids. He decided to leave such important information with BD-1. I only assume he chose BD-1 because he needed some sort of ability to store encrypted information. These exploration droids are good tools for that sort of thing. But I'm sure he's more than that. Please, I'm trying to collect my thoughts. Why does Grease take care of this thing? I've never seen him do it.
did it. I hope you're not hurt. What are you looking at? Who are you talking to? Uh, just my ship, the Manus. Good name, right? Intimidating. Oh, what do you know? You've probably never even flown a ship. Maybe I'll teach you one day, when you're done with your Jedi stuff. I'll even give you a discount. It's dangerous being on the run, huh? You're telling me. You lose someone? His name was Prof. Traded his life for mine. Sounds like a tough, strong guy. Not far from myself. He was. Since the day I stepped foot on Braca, he watched over me. Never complained. Never complained? On that trash heap? I just hope he didn't do it for nothing. I never do, kid. I never do. Nice landing, Grease. Me? Oh, yeah. Not a problem. It's easy for a skilled pilot like myself, especially when flying a ship like this. <laughs> This baby was a steal. <laughs> well, I mean, I didn't, I didn't steal it. I bought it. Well, I sort of, I almost. I mean, I took out a small loan. <laughs> Big loan, actually. No, it's fine. Look, we're all fine. Don't, don't worry about it. Don't, don't you have Jedi stuff to do? Get to it, kid. What do you want? You're up to something. <laughs> Nothing gets past old Greasy. I'm watching. Hey now. So what was in there? Watch out, BD. You don't look friendly. I'll check it out. Cal, can you hear me? The Empire. They found Zeppo. If they were following the Mantis, we would have been swarmed already. Could they be looking for the tombs? Let's hope not. Just got our comms working. I'll try the same workaround to crack into theirs. Thanks, BD-1.
The mother used this fabric to keep her child warm. They were on the run from something. Stem crate should be here. Wait, can you carry more? Thanks, Speedy One. something BD1? Okay, I'll look. and go. I'll lead them away. Alistair, no! All lies. The Empire just wanted this land. How did someone sneak in?
Where are you taking us? The Empire's forced the villagers from their homes. Frightened refugees, shipped off to work camps, or worse. Since I left Pagano, I've uncovered more about the Zepho than I once believed possible. This planet, their homeworld, has been a revelation. It appears many, yet not all the Zepho, could wield the Force. They called it the Life Wind, and those who wielded it, Sages. Three names appear with frequency. Aelrom, Mitral, Kujet. It seems these sages held esteemed positions within their culture. I've informed the Consul to... lukewarm reception. They have become too focused on Jedi history. But the history of the Force belongs to us all.
you know. What's that, baby one? Looks like a problem. Sure, he's still there. Crate was moved here by stormtroopers. They seemed anxious for some reason, pressured to find relics. of the Zepho. Guess we're on the right track, huh, BD?
find. Seer, there's a transport ship leaving the Empire's base. I heard. They plan to bring Zepho artifacts to Coruscant. Does that mean? That the Emperor is interested in Zepho? Maybe. Took out a trooper. job. Watch these grow.
They know. Is that me? job. In accordance with the Emperor's will, we have occupied Zepho, redistributing its inhabitants. This planet has failed to yield significant data or relics for Project Augur. Its electromagnetic winds have rendered the bulk of our mining technology useless. Meanwhile, more stormtroopers lose their lives to dangerous fauna. We will not be able to fulfill our directive here. It is my recommendation that we disband the project and leave a token outpost to keep scavengers from stealing our technology. lack proper leadership and motivation, which you cannot provide. You're relieved.
Found something. What do they know? No mention of Cordova. I don't think the Empire knows he's been here. Then we have the advantage. For now. Interesting. We're on the right track. Can't get through. There's a storm up ahead. Something about it crippled the Empire's equipment. I can feel something pulling me there, beyond the storm. Follow it. Let the force sharpen your instincts. All right. I'll do my best. Another one of these. I wonder if they connect. Oh. 
things are pretty cute. seen a storm do that before. Yeah, it's incredible. <laughs> <laughs> 